Alright people, welcome back. More daily duels. Oh my god, my family. My family, man. My family. <laughs> so, how y'all doing today? I'm pretty good, I'm pretty good. It's just... I've been trying to record this freaking video for like the last couple of minutes, and I swear to flipping god, I can't get it recorded. I can't, I can't, I can't. You know, I was like, this is literally my fourth recording. Freaking trying to record. Here comes a call from my dad, like, Mm. <laughs> you guys already know about that. Second recording, here comes a call from my cousin. Like, oh my god. Third call, here comes a call from my mom. Like, are you fucking shitting me right now? Like, what the fuck is going on? Anyway, people, we are using a new version of the Lord of Red deck that will involve more uh, red eyes. You know, uh, we'll hopefully get some red eyes action. I did not open up too fantastically, you know. I'm just asking to be fucking regeki right now. So, I guess I'll go ahead and summon my Metal Dragon back. Uh, and like I said, there's a couple of things that this deck does. Uh, of course, you can see this play. I'm only running one of each. I'm, I'm only running one Dark Pound and one Dark Dragon Ritual, because it's really all I need. Uh, just to get uh, Redim out, and Redim does plays. Uh, we're running the Red Eye Fusion, like, we are, we are running it all. So you're probably wondering, like, Daniel, what the fuck was the Charcoal and Patchy? Like, wh wh what is that? What What is that? <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, like, I only got one question for you. <laughs> what is that? No. <laughs> but seriously, uh, it actually has some synergy. For starting one, I'm still playing uh, Advanced Chart. So, with the Red Eyes being level 7, and I need another normal level monster to equate to 8 because for some odd reason, you know, load of red, they're just like, yeah, let's make them 8 and have, like, no synergy with fucking red eyes. Uh, I had to run a level 1 normal monster, so charcoal and patchy. But there's also other reasons why. Uh, another reason why, alright. It's just like, wow. And running that great old god Cthulhu summoned that insta-fusion Norton because why the hell not? Like, this man is just simply just gonna go the hell off, and that's just fucking great. Because Norton is so dumb. Like, I can't wait for Norton to be banned. Like, I just can't wait. I just can't wait for Norton to be banned. <laughs> fucking Lion King. But uh, another reason why it's in here is because we are running a lot of, uh... Uh, we're running a new plan that uh, Lunar suggested. So, we are running, uh... Junk Synchron, and Junk Synchron can summon a level 2, a 1 or 2 from your graveyard, and then you go ahead and sync it up, right? This is a level 1, but this is also a level 1, so I wanted to make sure that I had the consistency. And pretty much what we do is we, uh, alright, like I said, this guy just playing his outer entity, just playing the outer entity. And then of course, you know, I can't activate any card effects, so I can't even play my fucking shit, and he's just gonna whack my ass. Like, this man literally just beat my ass. I'm gonna scoop it up. I didn't open up that well, and he just is using this outer entity stupid Norton Insta Fusion shit. So I'm just gonna go ahead and surrender. <laughs> Let me go ahead and finish talking. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and summon Harold. So we're gonna go. Hopefully, it'll be this and not this. But hopefully, we'll go ahead and summon uh, Black Metal Dragon back with uh, Junk Synchron. Go ahead and Synchron summon into uh, Herald of Arc Light. This will go off and get me a Red Eyes card, Transmigration, or whatever Red Eyes card that I want to get. And then, when uh, Arc Light is built, I can get the Ritual Monster, so I can pretty much get a 2 for 1. But, you know, clearly this guy, he's just playing this OCG shit, and I don't I have no idea what it does. I didn't even open up that well. But uh, I had a play, and, you know, he makes it so I can't activate. You know, after this card is Exhumed, and your opponent cannot activate card, uh, Monster Effects for the rest of the turn, so I couldn't even activate my Black Metal Dragon to get me to search on. Not that I would have survived, because he's pretty a summon, 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 effect, summon, 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 so I'm gonna get fucking FTK to OTK anyway, but fuck it. And said, on paper, the deck looks fine, but we might have to go back on the, like I said, this deck won't be on here for much longer, I hope. Be right back. Alright, let's try this again. Hopefully we won't get an outcome like that anymore. You know what, I'm gonna go second. I'm gonna see if this deck likes to go second. Because on paper, I see some plays, but on not paper, I probably can't. So, hopefully we'll get some done. This person has no extra deck, so this is not looking promising. Maybe something sacky, I hope not. So here we go, here's like the all-star of the deck, there's that Junk Synchron. So, you know, if I get my, my advanced ritual out, I can go ahead and send Red Eyes, send uh, Charcoal and Pachi, go ahead and Junk Synchron, bring that back, like we have plays. Oh, never mind. Well, you still have plays, actually. Hey. Consistency, send that Dragon Shrine. 
Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of pen normal monsters. I, I want. I was thinking about maybe running a level one normal monster, just to have some more synergy with Junks and Chrome as well. But the problem is that the normal, the the only level one normal monster is uh, Flamebell Guard, and he's a tuner. So if I go Junks and Chrome, summon Flamebell Guard, they both tuner, so nothing happens. So we're just gonna go ahead and send you. And we'll go ahead and summon my Junk Synchron. And I guess I'll start beating this man with my junk. Because you guys know that I like beating people with my junk. But yeah, just my all my family. I'm playing one of him just in case I don't want to go into this. But yeah, we'll go ahead and go into uh, Herald of Arclight. I wonder if I just summon an attack and defense. I guess it really doesn't matter. Yeah, it really doesn't matter. There's nothing I really want to one for one right now. Yep. We'll go ahead and go off. Oh, and then I can negate and then <laughs> get additional sites now. Uh, see? So, we can get my Red Eyes Fusion, we can get anything we want, like, so good right now. I'm thinking about maybe just grabbing Red Eyes Fusion just in case shit hits the fan, because you already know, Red Eyes is dumb with Red Eyes Fusion, like, this card is fucking stupid. Yeah. And with it all being out of the picture, it's, uh, this deck is the deck that's like, hey, let me go ahead and fuse from the deck. Because, I mean, shit all, if you fuse from the deck, what are you really fusing? You can't go into Construct to handle the various situations where I'm summoning beefy monsters and forget about it, you know? So. I really haven't seen much of Shadal's since they got hit. No surprise, no surprise. So we'll go ahead and just red eye fusion it up, you know? So there's just a ton of plays. This uh, You can see the synergy, and I'm glad you Moon suggested it. I was literally sitting there, I, I, I knew you can call me an this. I was just like, how the fuck am I supposed to get this guy in the graveyard to do my plays? You know? How the fuck am I supposed to do that? Uh, I'm thinking about go ahead and negating that. Yeah, I'll go ahead and negate that. I don't like emergency teleport. Dude, nothing good has come from emergency teleport. Nothing. Yeah, you know, for all I know, he's just trying, he's gonna just try to summon a farm girl. He's just gonna just try to jump. I can't speak right now. Oh yeah, give me that advanced ritual art. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> fucking advanced ritual art. So I can go ahead and summon my fucking Lord of the D. You know, that that was the other deck. This is this is Lord of the Red deck. It's red eyes, in it? <laughs> well, like I said, on paper it seems like there's a lot more synergy. Watch him be playing fucking Cosmos, cause Cosmo don't need an extra. Oh my god, I was like, watch him be playing fucking Cosmos. Alright, well, I'm gonna get fucking OTK'd. Oh my god. You know what, I understand why you dislike Dando commentary. I totally do, because it's just Cosmos. Cosmos, 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 Cosmos. I fucking get it. I'm tired of seeing fucking Cosmos too. Like, oh my god, all we see is fucking Cosmos. Huh. <sighs> so I'm probably gonna get fucking wrecked. Probably gonna get wrecked. If he doesn't OTK me, I mean, I can I can totally come back, you know, I can go ahead and do my Red Eyes Fusion so in my fucking uh, Black Metal, I, I can I can fuck him up, I can totally fuck him up, because I can just attack over him. I'll have to draw a card out of it. But God, it's so annoying. Like I said, I would not be surprised if he just OTKs me right now. I'm, you know what? I agree, I agree, I'm sick and tired of Cosmos too. The only time I play Cosmos is on Daily Duels and... You know, that's it, that's it, yeah, and, it, and we're not even playing rated, like, that's the thing. If we were playing rated, I could understand, so we're not even playing rated, so I'm just gonna get fucking wrecked right now. Like, here goes, here goes a chunk out of my fucking life points, like, life points, who needs them? Psh, who needs them, right? Who needs them? Uh, and, of course, he has fucking Cosmo Town too, so. So, I'll just go ahead and Red Eyes Fusion some of my freaking... Uh, black Archfiend and run him over and he won't float of course because I'm like an Amadeus which is just great. I was thinking he's gonna get hit back but I believe that my D is higher than 18. I don't even know what my D is actually but what is it? It sucks that I can't special summon this during this turn. I'm running a lot of normal monsters so first the dragons in order just because I'm playing one in Stifusion just so. In the chance I go ahead and go into her I can do it. Yeah. So. Uh. Yep. 25. Yep, yep, yep. Watch him just be like Vanity, so I'll be like, oh my god, just fucking kill me now. Just fucking kill me now if that's that card's fucking Vanity. Alright. Go ahead and send a Summon Skull, go ahead and send a Red Eyes. And we'll just run you over. No floaty for you. Oh, I'm gonna turn to Red Eyes. You know what? Yeah, that's actually pretty good, because. Turn red eyes and get my adventure trailer on. Not bad, not bad. Uh, how many cards do I have? I have too many cards in my hand. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and set a card. I guess I'll go ahead and set this transmigration. It's good, but it's not great. I'm running one in comparison to the advanced ritual art. 
It's not, like I said, he's so lucky that I can't summon multiple shit. That's fine. He's so lucky. So, what you gonna do? Hopefully you have a Dark Destroyer. If you have a Dark Destroyer, that's game. That's game. If you have another one. Which would just be unfortunate for me. Because you would pretty much opened up the tents. Like, you opened up a farm girl, emergency teleport, like, you literally opened up the tents. Alright. So I guess the Good Witch is gonna go ahead and set me down, and then maybe he's gonna go ahead and summon something stronger than 25. Maybe like a Forerunner or something. You know. Alright, then I get your farm girl back. It's fine. That farm girl really can't do anything to me, so... I have plays out the ass. If I could just survive till the next turn, I got plays out the ass. Alright, I can go I can go one for one, pitch, summon, banish, summon, summon back my skull, venture charge, summon him back, summon that back. Like a foreigner? Because foreigner is the only No, it's another bank destroyer. So god you got lucky. You didn't even have to put me down. Like just wreck me. Like wow. Wow. So lucky. He just opened up the tits. Like I never open up with this when I play Cosmos. He, op he drew into Double Dark Destroyer, he drew into a, a fucking Cosmotown, because he never searched that. He drew into a Farm Girl, he drew into an Emergency Teleport, like he opened up the shit! He opened up the shit and beat my ass. I was thinking either, he had no extra deck, I'm like, either he's gonna play something Saki or he's gonna play Cosmos. And even if you're playing Cosmos, I would still have the, you know, the extra deck just as the fucking, uh, just in case, just in case, you know, always keep your toolbox on you, so. I lost against someone who thinks that they're so good that they only had to run an extra deck and got super lucky. I mean, it doesn't matter the skill. I opened up really well, too. Like I said, I could have win. I literally would have win. I was going I pitched the fucking Regeki. I don't need it because I'm about to wrap up this fucking duel. Summon my fucking, uh, uh, black. Banish, summon. Fet, summon. Venture Charge, pitch, summon. Summon. Like, oh my god, I could have went off. I could have went off. Let me try to get another duel in. Be right back. Alright, let's try this again. Duck doesn't run any back row, but I don't really have any room for a back row because I'm doing so much with this deck. Like, this deck is doing so much, people. Like, it is it is just going ham with it. Alright, oh, Drew. This would have been, been better to go first because I could have just said this, he would have killed it and then kind of, you know, emergency teleport, but it's cool. Oh, great. <sighs> Looks like I'm going to probably get infinity. Yep, infinity.deck. Like, wow, why is everybody being so dirty today? Everybody's just being so fucking dirty today. Like, oh great, yay, infinity, that deck. Fun. Oh my god, I'm so sick and tired of this fucking- I'm already sick and tired of this video, like that's pretty sad, right? That's already pretty sad that I'm already fucking sick and tired of this fucking shit. Ah, oh, so what does this say? You cannot normal summon or set monsters to turn you activate this card. I don't even know what I want to do right now. There's really nothing I can do. I can try to summon Mamju, he'll of course negate me. And if not, I can summon my Redum, but it just does nothing. Like, I literally have, like, nothing right now. I have nothing. Just like, no. Just fuck Infinity. Infinity, ah, oh, fuck Infinity, you eat dick. No, oh, activate it. You wanna negate? Like wow, just, just disgustingness. That's all I'm doing right now. It's just disgustingness. <sighs> I need a plan. I need a plan. Something to intimidate him. I can activate this and negate that. Then I can summon this. This summon that. Then I can banish it. Summon this and then attack over the infinity. But you know, even that's not the greatest of plans either. Just give me another red activation. He'll negate get it, then I'll just activate a second one. Like, oh my god. Alright, that's where you fucked up. You should've negated me. You should've negated me. Oh, well, if I ever get... Another place, go ahead and negate it. You have to negate it. Oh, and vanities too?! Fuck infinity and vanities! Wow. Alright. Wow, alright. Well, well, thanks, thanks for not allowing me to play. GG, yes. Infinity plus vanities. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Nothing. 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 Okay. 
Wow, it's just disgustingness. This entire video, it's just disgusting. This is my fourth recording, too. Ugh, oh, be right back. So. Ugh, oh, alright. I just want one fun duel. Like, I'm playing fucking Lord of Red, for goodness sakes. I mean, people are like, oh, Red Eyes is gonna be so good. Like, no, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. And, where is it today? Are you ready to what? I don't even know what that is. I don't know what that even that is. <laughs> I mean, am I ready to something? Like, hello? <laughs> wow. Alright. This is just, wow. Like, what am I doing? What am I doing? Well, I, can, I mean, I have some plays. They're not fantastic plays, but I have some plays. This is the problem with running fucking red eyes and shit. You just draw a whole bunch of fucking... Shit, you don't want to draw. <laughs> Never want to draw your normal monsters, like not at all. <sighs> so then, foolish. Now, when I foolish, I don't know. I don't know. Cause I got my Insta Fusion and my Norton. I guess I could send a level four. I think the only level four I'm really running is either my Ritual Monster, which I don't think I can summon back, or Nor or Nandu. The thing about running maybe a level four normal monster, I'm still debating that. Like I said, this deck is still in work in progress, but it has plays. I guess I'm gonna set this just in case it hits the fan. I can always cast down. So. Ah, it's just great. <laughs> Go ahead and run Ice Fusion. But please don't tell me. And it's funny. I open up the worst against this guy. Like if I lose to this guy, I'm just gonna just I'm gonna be done because this hand's bad. Like I really can't do much with Chuckle and Pachi. Like okay, I guess. What the fuck? <laughs> like, really? What the fuck? Is he just running, like, a, a dice deck? Like, wow. So, that works. So, deck. deck. I'll keep these guys in my hand just in case I have some plays, but I seriously doubt it. Does it say, what's it say? I can't be normal summoned or special summoned. Uh, I guess I can go ahead and set my truckle and Pachi. It's not terrible. This is 21 booty. That's literally the only reason I chose it. There's not a lot of good n not normal level 1 monsters. I mean, why would you ever think that there would be, right? I mean, with me being able to return my red eyes is with, uh, with him. I mean, it's not bad because truckle and Pachi will be ready to go in case I get my uh, transmigration. So. I don't know what the hell that was. He just kind of put my- he just banished my shit. Like, okay. <laughs> Like, I mean, the, the foolish Nanju play, that was just to be cute with Insta Fusion. Like, there was really nothing there that you had to be too afraid of. Yet you were, so. <laughs> Yet you were. Like, I probably don't even need the Northern plays, but the thing is just to be safe, and just in case I do this play. Seriously, doubt I ever will, but. <laughs> he is literally just playing the flip coins. Oh my god! Did this man literally just flip all heads? Wow. All right. All right. All right. The luck is too real, huh? Oh my god. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? I swear to god. I opened up like ass. This guy flips the tits. Like, what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? I'm lit. I, I, oh. What the fuck? And I open up like ass too. I think I'm about to just go Insta Fusion Summon Norton and, summon, and Tribute Summon for Summon Skull. Like wow. 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 Just fucking kill me now. Like what the fuck? What did it say? Well, um, sorry, but... Fucking the gate, I'll prevent this card. No, I don't want to do that. Like wow. Wow. Like what the fuck? Like I do it against fucking Infinity with Vanities. I do it against the guy who opens up the tits with Cosmos. I that opens up the tits with fucking elder gods, and now I'm losing against the I'm doing up against this fucking uh, guy who flips all heads on a fucking Gambler Legend card. Like wow, he could have just easily flipped all tails and fucking discarded his entire hand, or fucking pick one random card in my opponent's hand. I probably wouldn't mind that, or destroyed one of you know destroyed a card he could have. No, he's just gonna get the fucking tits. Oh my god, if he fucking gets this, like tails. Thank you. Suck my dick. That card's terrible. Never play Cup of Ace. Never. Ever. Yeah. Holy shit. 
Ah, <sighs> one more duel. Be right back. All right, last duel. Last duel. Eh? The deck is still kind of iffy. It's still kind of a red eyes deck, so it's understandable that I'm not getting the best of shits. But it's not bad. Once again, I'm only running one of these, and I get both of them. So I can I can probably get in this man's butthole like real tight. Like real talk, I can get in this man's butthole real tight. That sounds hella gay. I'll go ahead and get my search on. Go ahead and get that advanced ritual art. We got this play right here. So uh, I guess I'll play Rota. One my run Rota to get you. Like look at this number generated hand. One Rota. One uh, dark and dark dragon. One paladin. Like oh, send the manju. Summon. Use your effect. Tribute yourself off. Summon red him. I can go ahead and equip the black metal to my redum. Activate my redum. Send back my paladin. And if we get rid of my redum, then I get my search and I have plays for days, so. Up and up pretty well, pretty well, I must say. That was a nice chunk out of your life points, I must say. Dragon's made is fucking useless because I don't have no monsters, but I will in a sec. Go ahead and get rid of this so I can go ahead and start searching my fucking rituals and shit. Like, please, for the love of God. Go ahead, get rid of my fucking red him. Like, I'm literally only playing this just because it's a ritual in this deck, best rituals, and I can summon red him. And red him is just the tits, you know. You're like, red him can go up to two. Like, no, 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 no. No, no. <laughs> you know how fucking ridiculous fucking two red him would be? Like, no, no. Red, red him is deservingly sell at one. <laughs> it's, it's, it's on this spot at one. <laughs> Chaos Dragon Air, the Dragon Rilla Air, like any deck that plays dragons, here comes Redum, right? <laughs> Please do something. I want this last duel to be entertaining. Even if you got Regeki, Regeki me. So I can go ahead and get my search and then do plays next turn. I wish his name was. I can't even search fucking Lord of Red with this. Like, wow. What does Titan's Regression even do? Like, I, I can't remember. I think I banish or I, I do the tribute. Probably could have freaking went summon this, summon Manju, search for my my Lord of Red, and then this would have searching for transmigration, and I could have done this, but I think banishing this? I think banishing Red Eyes cards? Or is it Red Eyes no monsters? At the top of my mind, I don't remember. You know. So if it's banishing Red Eyes cards, I can totally banish my Red Eyes Darkness Metal, summon him, you know, and do it that way. Because with this, unless I get this soon, I can always go ahead and summon Junk. I need this to get unequipped, though. As soon as it gets unequipped, I can actually do something with the junk. So either you're just not going to do anything and you're just going to scoop it up and we're going to get one more duel, one more duel. Or you're going to do something and we're actually going to continue this duel because... Ugh. Luck. Walking number generator. I said... Uh, that, 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 I must say, that's my, that's my one problem with Yu-Gi-Oh. Wow. Wow, really. That's actually freaking disappointing. That you literally did nothing. I'm actually kind of pissed off about that. What can I activate? Oh, Dola. There's another reason why I play this. I can go ahead and ban it stash and search for a freaking Red Eyes card. So fucking good. What do you say? Oh, you can banish Red Eyes monsters from your grave right instead of whose total level equal to animal. Yeah, I can banish Red Eyes Dark Metal. Like, like, wow. You literally did nothing. I, I'm not even sure if you're here. So I guess I'll go ahead and play with myself. Say it took me a cool minute to make this deck. A cool minute, people. Like you don't even know. You don't even know how long it took me to fucking make this deck. I was like, no, do this. No, do this. No, do this. Look up decks. Net deck. Uh, get opinions on uh, how people to angle. Like it was. It was difficult. It was difficult. That was boring. You literally did nothing. I don't even know what deck you're playing. So one more duel. Be right back. All right. This will be the last duel, people. I will go ahead and go second, okay, so I can go rise fusion and crush you if I need be. Huh. Ten's not bad. Ten's not bad at all. So, got my Transmigration. Got my Lord of Red. So, maybe we'll get to go ahead and actually see Lord of Red in this duel, despite it being a Lord of Red deck. So, I might need to go back to the drum board when it comes to this deck, but the deck's not bad. The deck is not bad. It's just not getting anything. <laughs> yeah. You know what, I'm gonna go ahead and do this play because. Why? Why am I doing this play? You know what? Because it's fucking... It's just fusion, man. Fucking red-eyed fusion is just so stupid. Like, 
Who saw it? And, and it sucks because you have to you have to play Summon Skull. And I'm playing my favorite bird, and art of Red Eyes and my favorite art of Summon Skull. It just looks like he has more synergy with the Red Eyes when he's red like that. Yeah. Just you not know, like, oh yeah, summon fuse from your deck and summon a fucking 32 or maybe he's like that's that's cool. I'm thinking about not activating this fight just in case, because what they say? You must also choose monsters from Hand of Field or banish Red Eyes monsters from your graveyard, except for this who's taller. Totally Alright, so I can keep Red Eyes in there and then I can just banish my Red Eyes as one of the tributes to some of my Lord of Red. So, no, I'm gonna actually keep Red Eyes in there. I'm cool. Cool. And then just, just to put in the cherry on top, just in case you think you're gonna fuck me, I got another fucking Red Eyes for you. I'm like, <sighs> just so dumb. It's just so dumb. Yep, yep. And does a dark hole at me. Yeah, it's fine. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're gonna fuse? Yep, I was thinking it's like fluff. Please don't fucking wolf me and tank me fucking a whole bunch. Okay. I was like, if you did that, I would cry. I would cry. Oh, oh there's red as darkness metal right there. Interesting. I guess I'll go ahead and summon mind you. Sure. No. Uh I can get I can I can do I can totally do the freaking events for short art play. Hmm. I I can end this duel, actually. I can totally end this duel. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I can I can wrap this duel up. So I think this is much better than the dinosaur deck. The dinosaur deck did not go well. So we'll go ahead and send. I don't know why I said summon skull. Like <coughs> that should be right as in circle and patchy. And you got. Then you are a dragon. So I guess I'll go ahead and banish you. And though you just hit the field, and I would like to use you, but I have better plays. And then you can go ahead and summon back you. Thanks for Dark Hole and me, I'm still gonna fuck you up. I said, I, have, I just have plays for days. Go ahead and run over your monster. No, you won't float. Alright. <laughs> plays for days, people! That wasn't bad. I probably don't need the Maxis, I'll only run it just to have synergy with him, but, you know, it doesn't bring anything new to the table. I could probably go back. Uh, so, you still got it at least a week or two before this deck uh, had the potential of being taken off. But, it's getting there. It's getting there. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Daily Duel. It's driving me up the wall with the luck. Like, luck is just like, blah, 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 luck. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I, I'm an unlucky person. You guys know this. If you guys don't know, you should know. I'm an unlucky person. So that is good to not be able to, uh, not have to play competitive video game or not get unlucky in real life and just simply just have fun. Even though you know, I'm trying to, I just want to play some red eyes and entertain you guys. So anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed the Daily Duels. So thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. I will see you guys tomorrow. Playing them speed droids. Joined by a tag partner. You'll find out. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching.